Hello viewers, welcome to the second part of the song Poo Malaya Tol Chereva from Pagal Nilavu. If you would like to view the calls cover for the song, please see part 1 video link in the description below. In this second part, we are going to see the scale, the time signature, the chords and the strumming pattern. If you would like to view the complete chords for the song in both original version and the transposed version, please see the description below. Here we go. The scale of the song is originally in C minor. As I mentioned in my part 1 video cover, there are two chords which could be tricky to play in the original version and for this reason I have transposed this to B minor scale. So please place your capo on the first fret. Now we will look at the list of chords used in this song. There are only 5 chords used in the entire song. The first chord is B minor. The next chord is D major. The next chord is A major. The next chord is E minor. The last chord is E minor 6th. To play E minor 6th, just add your pinky on the 2nd string, 3rd fret. That is E minor 6th. The two chords I said in my part 1 video cover that could be difficult to play for beginners are E flat and F minor 6th. So transpose this to B minor scale. So they are D major and E minor 6th. Even E minor 6th could be tricky to play for beginners in the chord progression because this is a fast paced song but with practice this becomes easier. The time signature for the song is 4-4. Four, four. We will now look at the strumming pattern that I have used in my part 1 video cover. It goes like this. Slow, down, down up, down up, down up. Super slow, down, down up, down up, down up. With the actual tempo of the song. So that is the strumming pattern. We will now see the list of chords line by line starting from Pallavi. For the first line it is only B minor. It repeats. The next few lines we have only two chords D major and A major. The first two words of that line is D major. The next two words of that line is A major. So we will see all of those lines together. The next line is only B minor. The last line is E minor 6th. Goes to the first line. In the chord progression, switching from B minor to E minor 6th could be challenging to play because this is a fast paced song. A small trick that could help in the switching is when you play B minor for Pojai Mani Osai, Poe Manadasai, you play E minor for the next line Pudiyador for half a bar. Then you add your pinky to play the E minor 6th. So this should give you enough time to switch from B minor and then E minor 6th. So we will see this in the chord progression. One more time. Go to the first line. 
that is the end of Pallavi lines. We will now look at Charanam chords line by line. For the first two lines of Charanam, it is only D major. This repeats. The next line is only A major. The next two lines, Kanni Yeridum is B minor, Vanna Murudum is E minor, Vandu Thaduvum is A major, Janma Murudum is D major. This repeats. The last two lines of Charanam is very similar to the last two lines of Pallavi. So, Nalum Piriyamal is completely B minor, that line. And the last line is completely E minor 6th. You will try to apply the trick that we did in Pallavi for these last two lines as well. Goes to the first line. So that is the end of Charnam lines. We will now look at Charnam chords with a slow tempo of the strumming pattern. So that is the end of Charnam Chords. I hope you find this tutorial useful to follow. Thank you for watching.